This is Lee. What's up? So, I'm down at that motor inn, and, well, uh, I'm stuck. Stuck? Yeah, I uh, saw a chance to get some supplies for the group, and a bunch of the Roman ones got the jump on me. I'm hiding over here, but they won't leave. What's up? Glenn's trapped down at the motor inn. Hey, Glenn. We're gonna talk it over and send a group to come get you, all right? <laughs> awesome. I'll sit tight till then. Sounds good. I'm gonna hold on to this until we get Glenn back, okay? I'll take good care of it. What do you think? I think Doug's not great around zombies. You got your family here. I'll take Carly and her dead eye down to the motor inn, get Glenn, and get back here as fast as I can. If that's what you want to do, somebody's got to. Yeah, I'm in. Good. Doesn't sound too bad there right now. Let me know as soon as you want to head out. I could use a jog. Alright, I got a plan. Love an energy bar, sweet. I ain't going hungry. Um, where am I going? That's the restroom. Should I check that restroom just for the hell of it? Can I get in there? No, I can't check the restroom. I wanna. I have an idea. I think. But we're going back in, just gonna work. Alright. Now. There was a back door. How do I. I can't flip myself? I guess that doesn't matter, huh? Damn it. That's the door to the pharmacy. Yeah, we should be that? able to find pills for Larry in there. Pants came in here hoping to survive. Oh my god. But it looks like one of them was hurt. I wonder if it was my dad. <laughs> Trying to be a hero, maybe. Or a maybe protector, to... at least. Oh, I got an idea. See, like, before they showed me that, um... Like, I think it's over here, this door. The exit door. That a bookshelf was on. I can't see it no more. I bet you when we leave, we're gonna go out that door. This thing's so weird when it controls. Try to get some rest, hun. How can I with those things out there? Let's see. So, come on. Do, 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 do. The IT guy. energy bars in a remote. Am I the only one looking around for shit? What was that? Okay, I got one battery. batteries. There we go. Let's get that radio. Let's get that radio work. What was that? Ah, the fan. Son of a bitch. You know? Which way I'm supposed to? Uh, yeah. It just gets, it gets all stuck on me. This battery should fit the radio. There you go. Great. Thanks. And here's another one. Should be able to get it to work now. It's still not working? Yeah, I can't figure it out. 
Oh, Let me have yeah. a look at that thing. Go ahead. I'll get it to work. It's crazy, lady. <sighs> Nothing. Nothing. Let's put the antenna up. Make sure you have the batteries in right. There you go. Yep, the batteries are in the wrong. <laughs> well, I ain't saying nothing. She needs to turn the volume up. I'm gonna push the power on the switch. There you go. As the unknown you fixed it. continues to spread unchecked, the estimated death toll continues to skyrocket. WABE urges you to stay Jesus indoors Christ. and avoid any contact with individuals you suspect may have been exposed. The station is okay. In the event of a full. Uh, my, my producer's telling me we have to get off the air. Steve. Oh. Uh, oh my god. God bless you all. Um, should I talk to her or something? That's it? <laughs> Just like, that's it. That's it. Heard or seen anything? Nothing, luckily. Wanna step outside, have a look around? <laughs> I'm not suicidal yet. No, the gate out there is closed. We can hang out in front of the store and be fine. Oh, huh. Well, sure. Let's go have a look around. Cool. And we'll keep it down. Don't need to bring them back this way with any unnecessary noises. There you Agreed. Go. Jesus. Oh, look at the fuck? Oh, yeah, me they too. Just eat. As far as I can tell, that's all they care about. And if one gets you, they eat you. And whatever's left comes back as one of them. How the fuck? I think it might be more than a couple days before all this gets sorted out. Yeah, I think so too. We better keep it down out of here. Can't reach that brick. I can't reach it. Something's about to hop out of here, you know, right? Uh, Any idea where the pharmacy keys might be? We oh. searched high and low inside before you guys got here. They weren't on the old couple we took out of the office. Are you okay? I'm fine. If the keys aren't in the drugstore, think they could be out of here? We now live in a world where getting up and walking away is an actual possibility. So. Right. Oh, wow. Let's see. Oh. How'd you end up here? I moved here to live with my uncle. He does tech stuff and it just made sense. So you're local. You probably knew the owners of this place. No, not really. I've only been here a couple months and I spend a lot of time. On the computer? No, just <laughs> doing my own thing. What about you? I grew up here. Been trying to get home since the day I came back. Oh, so you probably knew the owners then? Yeah, I did. Good people. Can't reach that brick. Why is it there? I got a feeling I need that brick. Uh... Do you think we're safe here? Well, I haven't been able to get through this gate so far. And the drugstore's safe enough, I think. Whoever owned it took good care of it. It's well stocked and locks up well. Alright, let's get the far back inside now. If there's something about to happen, it's gonna happen. Let's head back inside. Okay. I don't know. This is just weird. Oh my god. Oh, 
You're a pretty good chef. Well, you don't fuck with a reporter, especially one that's three days out from her last cup of coffee. There you go. Uh, that radio sign-off didn't sound too good. Are you okay? I'm fine. You don't have to be. It's traumatic. I'm sure some people got out. Maybe they're all being rescued. Then again, maybe not. She's supposed to. Hey, Carmen. You seem to handle yourself pretty well. <laughs> really? I'm a disaster. I can't tell. My news editor was eaten about five feet away from me. And I would have joined her if it wasn't for that dorky guy on watch over there. I'm sorry. She was an asshole, but, you know. Yeah. That guy saved you? Yeah. Can you believe it? Those creeps, or, or ghouls, or whatever the hell they are. They were pulling our van apart, and that guy, Doug, just came to the rescue. You can never tell who the heroic ones are gonna be, I suppose. He's kinda cute. In that parent's basement sort of way. Huh? Huh? Oh, nothing. Oh, nice. How'd you end up here? We drove up to cover the Cherry Blossom Festival. Real hard-hitting stuff. Sounds worth it. You Let's ready go. to head out? You got it. You? Uh, In a minute. Okay, let me know. Let me talk to Clem before I go. How's your finger, Clem? Good. It doesn't hurt so much anymore. Good. I know I'm not your dad, but if you need anything, I'm your guy, okay? Okay. Same. You're my guy? Oh, no. <laughs> you know. We're gonna try to take care of each other. Yes. Deal. Let me know if you need anything. Okay. That's the plan. That was the plan. I, I don't know how to get the keys. I'm pretty sure it's... I'm gonna head out and see if that guy and see what happens after that. Hey there. Let's you go. ready to head out? You got it. You? Yeah. Let's go.